All right, guys, buckle up. No intro at all. Let's do this. Hey, wow. That's so big. How are you care? Purchase big, lots of stuff is big. Well, God what a start to this video. We're only five seconds deep and I have so many questions. I guess we'll just start off with man bun over here. He's just walking around with the printer. Yeah, that's normal. Oh, it's a beautiful day. I thought I'd take my printer for a fucking walk. What the hell, V-neck? Typical douchebag. That's so big. How are you care? Purchase, purchase big, lots of stuff is big. He really had to bring his dick into the conversation here. Purchase big, lots of stuff is big. Wow, now that is smooth right there. Yeah, this printer is pretty big, but you should see my dick. <laughs> Come on. On, man. Purchase big, lots of stuff is big. I listed for 120. Okay, yeah, I only have $20 on me. I'm hoping that we can make an exchange. We could probably trade something other than money, I imagine. Okay, well, at least it's starting to make sense a little bit here. We're slowly putting the puzzle together. Looks like this guy's out here trying to sell his printer. So this girl comes up to him and offers him $20. And he says, oh, no, 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 that's not enough. Come on. So she basically just says, okay, well, how about we f you know, uh, what's what's that word for it? Um, prostitution? Yeah! This is some next level sh**. This is underground printer prostitution. IPP for short. We need to raise awareness, people. There are way too many printers being sold for sex. Do you think this is the life that these printers want to live? Absolutely not. Being sold for sex is just awful. Alright, for $20 and a hand job, this dude's about to sell his printer. You will not find these kind of deals at Best Buy. I don't care what kind of coupon you have. Plus, I'm not really sure if any of us want to get touched up by the geeks squad anyways. They scare the shit out of me. I have other things I can show sure. you and give you and do you work out? Mm. <laughs> do you have a six pack? Let me see. Yeah, lift up wow. Shirt. Oh, shit. I totally forgot that there's a girlfriend watching in the corner. God damn, I Justine has let herself go. Either way, I can fully understand her anger right now, okay? This dude's about to cheat on a girl to sell his printer. She's like, how dare he sell that printer for sex? He knows I need those printers for work. No wonder we've gone through five in the past month. He knows I have a passion for drawing artwork on Microsoft Paint. It's not that good but I'm working on it. But how dare he sell that printer for sex? She's a seven at best. You don't have a girlfriend though, right? No. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Sometimes people don't bring all the money on Craigslist that is cash. Hey, how about we all don't start talking at the same time? I didn't catch a word out of anybody's mouth. I have no idea what anyone just said right there. This is literally what I heard. Hey, yo, yo, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure my yelling. There's a whole lot of yelling going on. I'm yelling. My boyfriend is cheating. I don't know the guy who edits these videos, but goddamn, you need some practice. Yeah, I mean, I think I'm pretty cute. What do you think? <laughs> Think you can? God damn, douchebag of the year. Calm down. All she did was ask you if you thought she was cute. I don't really think that means touch my ass. If I have that wrong, you guys gotta let me know, okay? I could have been touching girls' asses this whole time. God damn. Hey, Tro, do you think I'm cute? I don't know. Let me touch your ass and find out. Makes sense to me. By the way, are we keeping track of these douchebag moves? All right, we gotta be on like seven by now. You know, what? make it ten, man. Even douchebags think this guy is a douchebag. You can accept that. What I need to see. Oh, really? Oh, really? How about 120? <laughs> <laughs> All right, 120, no money. Why don't you show me inside then? Yeah, let's go inside. <laughs> I really can't believe this is going over this well. Who would have thought that a printer could get you some action? I feel like this is gonna bust into a Walmart commercial, advertising their new printer specials. Walmart, save money, live better get laid for a printer. By the way, did I miss something here? Where did his printer go? I don't know if I just completely missed him setting it down somewhere. I'm not gonna rewind the video to watch. That's way too much work. I'm just really confused. Either way, let's just move on. Hold on, I'm gonna tell you, so we still have the audio when they went inside, all right? So they went inside, the microphone there asked me what to do because she didn't know. I mean, I don't know how bad that is to you. Uh, it's pretty I'll bad. I don't just, think I wanna hear that. This is how it ends, just so you know. Yeah. Come on, babe. You know I never cheat on you. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. In fact, what? will you marry me? What? What the fuck? Bro, what the hell? This is really what it was the whole time? A way for you to ask her to marry you? Are you kidding me? Like, what the hell's the girlfriend thinking? Oh, how romantic. This is exactly how I dreamed it would be. Pretend to cheat on me with a girl over a printer, and then you get on one knee. That was beautiful. <laughs> <Woo>! <laughs> yes. Turn around. What are you doing? 
behind you. No, you really, just... look behind you. <laughs> Will you marry me? Okay, you're really going through with this, Ashley? Or Jessica, or whatever your name was? Why don't they ever say their names in these videos? I'm sick of making up names for all these people. They gotta start wearing name tags or some sh**. Anyways, back to the point. Five seconds ago, Amanda thought she was getting cheated on. And just like that, she forgave him that quick. These bitches be tripping. Yes! You pranked me, or you, you set me up. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Oh my god. So that is a yes, right? That's yes! Yes! <laughs> It was an illusion. And just like that, let's give him one last douchebag point. Congrats, man. That is a new douchebag record. Here's your trophy. Well, guys, I'm glad that came out to a happy ending there. And I'm glad you could join me in another episode of How to Turn a 3-Minute Video into Almost a 7-Minute Video. But either way, guys, you already know the deal. If you did enjoy, then make sure you drop a like. I will love you forever. And if you share this video with a friend, family, your dog, cat, grandma, whoever, take a screenshot of the text and send me it over on Twitter or Instagram. I will make sure I respond back. And of course, if you're not subscribed by now, I have no idea what you're doing. Hit that subscribe button. My Twitter and Instagram always lit. Come through. But guys, I hope you did enjoy, and I will see you in the next one.